Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Give Me Five Children's Book Review with Missy and Elizabeth. Missy, how are you today? I'm doing good, Elizabeth. How are you? I'm really good, thank you. And would you like to introduce our book this week? Yes, I would. It is an adorable little book called The Everyday Adventures of Papa and Paws. It's a book about Molly Paws and her new little sisters. The twins take over, yes. And, you know, she's very bewildered through the whole thing. And I think this is a great message for kids to learn as well as adults, right? Is oh, about yes. sharing. Yeah, I think we, we all have a, a lesson to learn about sharing. It's a, a lesson that we keep on learning. It's a true story. And especially for like an only child or children who are, you know, starting preschool or kindergarten and they have to learn to sit at a desk with other children and share their crayons and their paper. Yes. You know, it's it's difficult because they kind of go through that mind stage, right? Oh, most definitely. And and this poor little uh, puppy dog, Molly, uh, gets these two new twins into her house and they're taking over her bed and taking her toys. And so, yeah, it's a, it's a hard lesson to learn sometimes. It sure is. And then she feels kind of abandoned, too, at, by her parents, by her people parents. She thinks, of course, all the attention is going to the, the yes. They need a lot of attention. So it would be natural right. for the oldest one to feel left out. Oh, most definitely. Yeah. And then a lot of times it's just the parents' reassurance that, hey, we got enough love to go around for everybody. Yes. And I like how the, the people parents step in and say, OK, we're going to learn to share. And this is for everybody and there's you know a good lesson for us to learn here together as a family and grow together yes because family is what it's all about isn't it it sure is and it's it's cute because once they molly learns that she stops fighting the process of the puppies and realize they're puppies and they're taking over her food dish and they're taking over her bed and her toys that right. maybe that's not so bad so no no because yeah. then you've got extra people extra extra puppies mm -hmm. to uh, and share adventures with yeah and like papa pa says you can learn to have fun as a big sister and she does yes she does yes she does it just takes her a little bit to adjust and to understand that they're that they're still babies they're still they learning and she can take the role on as a big sister and teach them Absolutely. And I think this is such like, once again, it's, this is a learning stage uh, message that is huge for kids. And so this book here, when we're reading it at nap time or bedtime, will bring up a lot of questions, but it's a great way to get the message across in a fun way through the characters of Molly and the twins. Exactly. And of course, a happy ending when they learn that they can get along and share and that it's fun to be a big sister and it's fun to be bigger, a bigger family, right? Right. Yes, most definitely. I think it was a good lesson for her to learn, uh, to share with the others. And like I said, it's a lesson that we are all learning together. Absolutely. And I really highly recommend this book, you know, as a beginner book, a nice little nap time book for your children and uh, learning as a learning tool for the family. It's, it's a great way to address you know, children that have a very hard time learning to share their family, their toys, their space. That's a great message. Yes, I think so, too. It's a great little message for everybody. Absolutely. And it's not the only book in the series, too. Uh, there are three books in this series. So we have Molly's Adventures, we have The Twins Takeover, and we also have Gracie, an, a new book. So I think that if you get out, get the set, then it would be really fun for the kids to start with the book one, go to book two and book three and continue on with the, the little adventures of these adorable puppies, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah. You definitely can't just read one. <laughs> no, you really can. And I really feel the author did a great job relaying this message in a very simple format that's easy to understand and fun for the kids. And um, so the description box below tells all about our author so you can find more about him and links to the books with our brave little Gracie and the twins take over and Molly Paul's and all of her adventures check it out description box below.